In this episode, we're going to be talking about our desktop versions of lasers and in particular, the ones that do marking. So all three of our lasers, like this one in front of me, have a similar footprint on a table and look very similar between all three. So let's first start with our fiber laser. So our first laser here is our fiber laser. Now basically what the fiber laser does is it marks anything that is metal and it is specifically meant for that reason. So you can go ahead and do aluminium, stainless steel, mild steel, lead and almost any other metal that you can think of. And that's basically what the fiber laser is meant for, marking and doing extreme detail on metal only. Then we have got something like this one as well, our mopper. And the mopper is also exactly meant for metal only, but the only difference is, and which is very cool, is you change the frequency and then you get a different color output on your actual item that you're engraving. So if you're wanting blue or green or a shade of purple, you just change the frequency and then you can mark and engrave on a piece of metal with a completely different color within that same logo, which is pretty cool. And lastly, we've got our UV laser. Now, unlike our two that we just mentioned, that one can do almost any substrate in terms of marking and with absolute precision. It gives you a really good detail on almost any substrate, wood, metal, glass, even done perspex, mirrors, and plastic. And last, you can even do paper and cardboard if you wanna do a different kind of etching. So in terms of that, that machine can do a lot more, which means it has a great versatility for marking on different substrates. The only thing is that you cannot do certain things like changing your color and making sure that you get a different color engraving, which can only be done on the mopper. So there's a very big difference between those three in terms of what you need it to do. So just keep that in mind when you're wanting to do marking and a desktop version without having something that's too large and 220 to be precise in terms of the marking area, you have to keep in mind which one will be best for you. So being said, the UV can do almost any substrate and your fiber and mopper are only meant for metal. So if you're going to engrave and do something on a piece of metal, for instance, you may just want to spend less money and go straight for the fiber. But if you've got the bucks for it and you want to do everything, then go straight to UV. If you're not worried about doing a color engraving on metal, then go for the mopper. Now that you know all three different types of lasers that we've been talking about, I encourage you to come on over to our showroom here at AM. As you can see, there's always people here looking at all the machines. Have a look at the samples that we've engraved so you can see which one is best for you. And as always, I'd like you to go ahead, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click the bell icon so that you can get notified on any next videos that come through. But if this is too small for you, we're going to be doing our CO2 lasers desktop and much bigger in the next video. So keep your eyes peeled.